What is going on Ian here with another video featuring Pokemon Go and it's one that I was not actually expecting to make. I genuinely thought the next video I would make would be for the global Hoenn tour back in London on Saturday but there is good reason. When I was at the Horseshoe Bend in Arizona yesterday I should have claimed my shaman. Now because I was stuck in a sandstorm I literally totally forgot to claim it so I'll be claiming that later but while we're at it, I did get this little bad boy, the Panport Shiny, which I already do have, uh, Golden Raz, uh, yep. I got this at the GoFest in Seattle. Let's go Ultra Ball. Come on, there we go. Oh, and there we go, the excellent throw. Got this at the GoFest in Seattle, so I didn't actually need it, but to get one with the Las Vegas Geotag is a great way to finish this trip. So that is caught. And as I said, it's my last day here in the States. Plans change massively from what I was originally going to do because I should actually be on Flagstaff now, but the weather won't permit it. That is dead, but it doesn't matter. So, plan for today is I need to record the podcast in two hours. I also need to find a park uh, because I'm actually back in Vegas. Wasn't planned. I think I'll probably go back to Sunset Park to claim the shame. It'd be a nice way to bookend this trip. So we'll claim that later. And of course... If anything else turns up, we'll see what we can do with that. But regional to start the trip, podcast recording starts in two hours, and it is now nine o'clock. Actually, it's quarter to ten, so I think Starbucks is definitely calling. literally back at the car and the shiny look continues with the shiny Stantler so you know what we've said it before we'll say it again what better place oh we don't want that we want to go silver pineapple what better place to catch Pokemon than in a parking lot and there we go great ball we hit the good throw on it I think it was excellent throw too busy talking and shiny Stantler second shiny caught here on the last day and I think I'm going to head back to Sunset Park now to catch my Shaman, which I should have claimed yesterday. But it was snowing, dusty and windy. I'm back here at Sunset Park where it all happened a couple of days ago just a couple of days ago can't believe I'm saying that it kind of feels longer so I'm back here with the intention of doing just one thing I'm gonna catch my shaman which I'm good that I didn't catch at the uh, horseshoe bend but it is what it is we cannot change these things as you can tell look there's still so many stops that I didn't spin so many stops that I didn't spin and the park is dead and I have great cellular service so you know small wins for space in that gym there so we'll drop a Pokemon in that gym when we get a little bit closer after we've done this need to go grab a bite to eat then head to the airport and catch my flight back at 10 p.m. tonight so I arrive back in London at 4 30 p.m. tomorrow I'll give me enough time to polish the podcast that Milo is currently editing and then get a little bit of a sleep and do the global Hoenn tour in Walpole Park severely jet lagged and let's just drop that slacking in there there we go that'll get us a few coins let's catch the shaman over here by the lake this is where the best of the gameplay was the other day and considering yesterday was snowy and stormy. Beautiful day today. Absolutely beautiful day today. And just look at that. The sun isn't going down, but just look at that view. I think this is as good a place as any to claim 
our shaman from the global go fest last year of course we've got the one in seattle which is geotagged with seattle and this one i just didn't want to be tagged at home as i said about a million times during this video i wanted it to be geotagged with page arizona horseshoe bend but it wasn't to be but there we go there's our shaman and I can't remember, this is probably going to be the three jump outs, two jump outs before we catch, but we'll see. Great throw. There we go. One, two, jump out. Yeah, there we go. So this is it. Our Vegas Shaman, which I've been sitting on for a long time. I might even be able to finish some of the other special research that I've been stacked up. Okay, so it's two star. We knew it was going to be bad, but at least it has the Las Vegas geotag, 23rd of the second. You know what, we'll take it. So this is actually a very pretty park. Genuinely a very, very pretty park. And it was a good choice for a location for the event. Of course, now it's windy. At the weekend, it was windy. And when you've got a lot of dust and the wind kicks up, I think one thing's going to happen. There's going to be dust, sand in everybody's faces, which has kind of been the theme of this uh, last week for me. But it's one of those things where you kind of live and you learn. But we'll just do one lap of the lake before I head back. And then it's off for food and the airport. I'll just leave with this thought that, although I was frustrated on Saturday, and that's an understatement, I don't want to tarnish the feeling that we got from the event, so I'm just going to have to put it behind me and just understand that sometimes these things are going to happen. Unfortunately, with Pokemon Go events, it's more often than not, but what can you do?